Say hey guys. Hey guys. Okay, we're here for a tutorial. The boys tutorial. Woo! Okay, so this guy has such, oh, such awesome straight hair. And to do his, you just comb it nice. <laughs> Woohoo! Next tutorial. This guy has luscious long locks. And to comb his, every day you just take the Wet Brush Pro and, oh, that's so nice. And he got an owie, huh? Should we taste it better? Okay! <laughs> and for me, so what I do is I get out of the shower. Um, I usually use head and shoulders because sometimes I have a little dandruff. Get out of the shower, do a nice scrub, push it back, and then here's the key. You grab your hat, and yet as you're holding it back, you put it on. Alright! <laughs> okay, so... If you guys just saw Brody and the boys, I was setting up to do a tutorial and they decided to hop in. So I walked in on them doing it and I'm pretty sure they should take my place now. But anyways, I've had a bunch of questions about my top knots. I know I filmed this so once or twice before, but it was really bad quality. For some reason people are having a hard time following it. So we're going to try it one more time because now with bangs, that's like one of my favorite looks is top knots so and normally to be honest I would do it when my hair is a little bit messier than this but I just wanted to get it done and show you guys it today um, super easy literally takes me 10 seconds you gotta get the hang of it and then it will take you 10 seconds at first it might take you a little longer but I usually need, need like two hair things and all you're gonna do is get it as high up on your head as you can just because more than likely it's gonna fall down a little bit don't worry about having it be too perfect I think that's kind of the key is you want it to be messy so I'm just gonna quickly put my hair up high get all this weirdness going on here okay then at the end I'll kind of pull more pieces out all I'm gonna do is get my hair thing around my wrist okay I take two fingers I wrap the hair in front of the two fingers then you like pinch the hair, pull it up, and twist it, and then you're just gonna open it to two sides and pull into a bun. I'll show you again. And then all I'm gonna do from there is put my hair thing in. And then you'll have a few pieces like this that are whole poking out higher than you want. You just tuck them into your hair thing, and you're good. Then I'm just gonna take my second hair thing, just kind of push it down even more into a ball and put that around it a couple times. Now, if you noticed, I left some hair out. I did that on purpose. If your hair is long enough, you should do that. Sorry if you guys can still hear the boys in the background. Just because I like to kind of pull those around, keep it even messier. I'm having a hard time mirroring you guys. And that way, okay. I'm really having a hard time. There we go. That way you'll just have the few messy hairs sticking out and you have your top knot. So I'm going to show you one more time because it really is super easy. Okay, so one more time. And hopefully it makes a little bit more sense seeing it a second time. Okay, so pull it up high. Take your two fingers, wrap it around front. Clamp your thumb and fingers, twist it up so it's like a long bun right now, and then just kind of pull it in half and scrunch it down on your head. I'm just going to take my hair thing, wrap it around, and then tuck whatever pieces in are hanging out a little too much. And then I'm going to take my second hair thing. And then there is my messy bun. I know that seems like so silly that that's all that it is. See, and then I'll take these extra hairs that are hanging out and kind of spread them around. But yeah, it's as easy as that. And then I'll just pull down more pieces, pull down pieces from here. 
and just kind of wear it all day so it just gets wow that piece is weird right now so it just gets like kind of messier throughout the day that's kind of what you want so anyways I hope this makes more sense maybe I'll even like slow-mo part of it so you guys can see it closer but it's super easy once you get the hang of it it'll just take you a couple seconds minutes but anyways yeah thanks for following guys and let me know what other tutorials you want to see and I will get working on them more. Thanks. Bye.